welcome friends myself dr deepak vishwanath dokre assistant professor department of commerce kdhm college nashik today we are discuss about insurance chapter number 1 introduction to insurance in our previous lecture that time i was explain syllabus of insurance and transport semester 1st today we are focus on insurance this is lecture number 2 in this lecture we are discuss introduction of insurance nature of insurance scope of insurance okay i repeat again introduction of insurance nature of insurance scope of insurance okay what about insurance introduction of insurance or definition of insurance insurance is a social device for eliminating or reducing the cost to society of certain types of risk generally an insurance agreed to be a valid contract must be a contract between an insurer and the insured the contract is based on the loss due to happening or not happening of a future incident a consideration in the form of payment of an amount by the insured and the insurer promises to make good the loss in so far many can do it in case the loss occurs on the happening of the contingency in india irda irda means insurance regulatory and development authority give guidelines to insurance sectors irda's headquarters hyderabad telangana irda's chairman ts vijayan insurance regulatory and development authority irda is an autonomous apex statutory body which regulates and develops the insurance industry in india it was constituted by parliament of india act called insurance regulatory and development authority act 1999 and duly passed by the government of india the agency operates from its headquarters at hyderabad telangana where it shifted from delhi in 2001 the irda act 1999 was passed as per the major recommendation of the malhotra committee report 7 january 1994 which recommended establishment of an independent regulatory authority for insurance sectors in india later it was incorporated as statutory body in april 2000 in our screen definition of insurance insurance is contract between two parties one the insurer and second the insured whereby the insurer agrees to undertake the risk of the insured in consideration of some amount known as premium and in return promises to compensate a fixed sum of money to the insured party on happening of an uncertain event like death okay nature of insurance nature of insurance insurance is a form of contract or agreement under which one party agrees in return for consideration to pay an agreed amount of money to another party to make good for a loss damage or injury to something of value in which the insured has functionary interest as a result of some uncertain event on the basis of the definitions of insurance discuss above one can observe the following 
नेचर्स और कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ इंश्योरेंस नंबर फर्स्ट कॉन्ट्रैक्ट इंश्योरेंस इज अ कॉन्ट्रैक्ट बिटवीन द इंश्योरेंस कंपनी एंड द पॉलिसी होल्डर वेर इन द पॉलिसी होल्डर इंश्योर्ड मीन्स इंश्योर्ड मेक्स एन ऑफर एंड द इंश्योरेंस कंपनी इंश्योरेंस कंपनी मीन्स इंश्योर एक्सेप्ट हिज ऑफर द कॉन्ट्रैक्ट ऑफ इंश्योरेंस इज ऑलवेज बेड इन राइटिंग सेकेंड कंसिडरेशन लाइक अदर कॉन्ट्रैक्ट देर मस्ट बी लॉफुल कंसिडरेशन इन इंश्योरेंस ऑल्सो द कंसिडरेशन इज इन द फॉर्म ऑफ प्रीमियम विच द इंश्योर्ड एग्रीज टू पे द इंश्योर नंबर थ्री कॉपरेटिव डिवाइस ऑल फॉर वन एंड वन फॉर ऑल इज द बेसिस ऑफ बेसिस फॉर कॉपरेशन द इंश्योरेंस इज अ सिस्टम वेर इन लार्ज नंबर ऑफ पर्सन एक्सपोज टू अ सिमिलर रिस्क आर कवर्ड एंड द रिस्क इज स्प्रेड ओवर अमंग द लार्जर इंश्योरेबल पब्लिक देयर फोर इंश्योरेंस इज अ सोशल कॉपरेटिव मेथड वेर इन लॉसेस ऑफ वन इज बॉर्न बाय द सोसायटी नंबर फोर प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ फिनान्शियल रिस्क एंड इंश्योरेंस इज अ प्रोटेक्टेड फ्रॉम फिनान्शियल रिस्क विच कैन बी मेजर्ड इन टर्म्स ऑफ मनी एज सच इंश्योरेंस कॉम्पेन्सेट्स ऑनली फिनान्शियल और मॉनिटरी लॉस और रिस्क नंबर फाइव रिस्क शेयरिंग एंड रिस्क ट्रांसफर इंश्योरेंस इज सोशियल डिवाइस फॉर डिविजन ऑफ फिनान्शियल लॉसेस विच मे फॉल ऑन एन इंडिविजुअल और इज फैमिली ऑन द हैपनिंग ऑफ सम अनफोर्सिंग इवेंट्स वेन इंश्योर द लॉस अराइजिंग आउट ऑफ द इवेंट आर शेयर बाय ऑल द इंश्योर्ड इन द फॉर्म ऑफ प्रीमियम देयर फोर द रिस्क इज ट्रांसफर फ्रॉम वन इंडिविजुअल टू अ ग्रुप नंबर सिक्स based upon certain principles the insurance is based upon certain principles like insurable interest at most good faith indemnity sub obligation causa proxima contribution extract regulated by law number 7 regulated by law insurance companies are regulated by statutory laws in almost all the countries in india life insurance and general insurance are regulated by life insurance corporation of india act 1956 and general insurance business nationalization act 1972 and irda regulation extract okay number 8 value of risk before insuring the subject matter of the insurance contract the risk is evaluated in order to determine the amount of premium to be charged on the insured several methods are being adopted to evaluate the risk involved in the subject matter if there is an expectation of heavy loss higher premiums will be charged hence the probability of occurrence of loss is calculated at the time of insurance number 9 payment and contingency an insurance is liable to pay compensation to the insured only when certain contingencies arises in life insurance the contingency the date or the expiry of the term will certainly occur in such cases the life insurer has to pay the assured sum in other insurance contract the contingency of fire accident or the marine perils may or may not occur so if the contingency occurs payment is made otherwise no payment need to made to the policy holder number 10 insurance is not gambling 
and insurance contract cannot be considered as a gambling as the person insured is assured of his loss identified only on the happening of such uncertain event as stipulated in the contract of insurance whereas the game of gambling may either result into profit or loss insurance is not a charity premium collected from the policy holder under an insurance is the cost risk so covered hence it cannot to take as a charity charity lacks the elements of contract of indemnity and compensation of loss to the person whosoever makes it insurance is not a charity number 12 investment portfolio since insurance liability to pay compensation to the insured arises on the happening of certain uncertain event the insurer do not have to keep the collected premium with them they invest the premium received in selected securities and earn interest and divided on the on them thus the insurance have two interest dividend which occurs over time nature of insurance we are discuss number first contract number second consideration number three cooperative device number four protection of financial risk number five risk sharing and risk transfer number six based upon certain principle number seven regulated by law number eight value of risk number nine payment at contingency number ten insurance is a not gambling number 11 insurance is not a charity and lastly investment portfolio okay after that we are concentrate scope of insurance are you ready for that okay scope of insurance number first personal insurance personal insurance refers the loss of life by accident or sicknesses to individual which is covered by the policy the insurer undertakes to pay the sum insured on the happening of certain event or an or on maturity of the period of insurance this insurable sum is determined at the time of affected the policy and include life insurance accident insurance and sicknesses insured life insurance contains the element of investment and protection which the accidental sicknesses or health insurance contain the element of indemnity only it's a personal insurance second property insurance in property insurance contract of property insurance is contract of indemnity proved by the assured of loss is an essential element of property insurance the policy of insurance against burglary home breaking or theft extract fall under the category the assured is required to protect the insured property after the loss has taken place the assured usually required to notify the policies as to losses there are very complex process when we try to claim insurance for loss or damage number 3 liability insurance in liability insurance liability insurance is the major field of general insurance whereby the insurer promises to pay the damages of property or to compensate the losses to a third party the amount of compensation is paid directly to third party the field of liability insurance include workman compensation insurance third party motor insurance professional and 
इंडेमिनिटी इंश्योरेंस एंड थर्ड पार्टी लायबिलिटी इंश्योरेंस एक्सट्रैक्ट इन लायबिलिटी इंश्योरेंस देयर मे बी वेरियस रीजन फॉर द अराइजिंग ऑफ लायबिलिटी वाइज एक्सीडेंट टू अ वर्कर एट द वर्क प्लेस डिफेक्टिव गुड्स एक्सप्लोजन इन द फैक्टरी ड्यूरिंग द प्रोसेस ऑफ प्रोडक्शन फॉर्मेशन ऑफ पॉइजन गैस विद इन द फैक्टरी ड्यू टू द यूजेस ऑफ केमिकल्स एंड अदर सच सब्सटेंसेस इन द मैन्युफैक्चरिंग प्रोसेस नंबर फोर फिडेलिटी गारंटी इंश्योरेंस इन फिडेलिटी गारंटी इंश्योरेंस इज द टाइप ऑफ इंश्योरेंस द इंश्योर अंडरटेक टू आइडेंटिफाई द एश्योर्ड एश्योर्ड मीन्स एम्प्लॉयर इन कंसिडरेशन ऑफ सर्टिन प्रीमियम फॉर लॉसेस अराइजिंग आउट ऑफ फ्रॉड ऑन द पार्ट ऑफ द एम्प्लॉज this kind of insurance is frequently adopted as a precautionary measures in cases where new untrained employees are given position of trust and confidence okay in scope of insurance we are discuss about personal insurance property insurance liability insurance and lastly fidelity guarantee insurance these are the references of our topic okay thank you you have any question we are discuss in our online